Hi, I'm making this video because there are a lot of coins out there that there's a lot of risk in this cryptocurrency world and a lot of people don't know how to evaluate risk and what to look for. And a lot of times you buy a coin that your friend purchased or your friend is purchasing and all you see is the values of these cryptocurrencies going up and basically all the coins are going up so everything looks good, you get excited and you want to jump on board and just start investing. The first thing I would look for to make sure you're not getting a, a scam coin or one that's going to be shut down is look at the ownership of the coin. Do the founders own 50%, 80%, 20%? Find out what ownership they have. I mean, there could be 800 billion coins and they might own 75% of those coins. So it's a very thin amount of coins that makes the price go up and down. So if they owned very few of those coins, it's a more realistic value of that particular coin. Also, you got to be careful about the fake news um, or just someone really pushing a certain coin because if someone, for example, there's a coin called Power, Power Coin, I think it's called, and there's a rumor that Elon Musk is getting involved with that coin, and that should make the coin go crazy. It should go up a lot. And if people keep spreading that story, and it might or may not be true, but the founders who founded the coin could just say that. And that brings a lot of interest because everyone wants what Elon Musk is doing. So you got to be careful to make sure that's true, it's verified. And the coin could go from $0.05 cents to $20. And the founders make a fortune and they could dump all their coins. So make sure the news is true and it's accurate. Also, you want to have a coin that has actual usage. So you don't want to have a coin that just has a cute name, like there's Doggy Coin. Like, what does that do? I mean, it has a cool name. You like dogs? All right, I have a Doggy Coin. You might call your dog a doggy. But if a coin doesn't do anything like have certain payments or certain security or just help in some way, do something for society, you might not want to touch that coin either. Even if people purchase it that you know they're making money on the coin. Also, another thing with the coins is you'll see these coins spike in value. You got to be really careful because it seems like coins get pumped up in value, then they get sold off, and then other coins get pumped up in value and sold off. So just be careful not to just jump on something because it's going up because you might be caught at the end. The last man standing, as soon as the music stops. Also, another big factor is a lot of the coins are based on Bitcoin price. You see, Bitcoin is the, basically we'll say the number one coin that you have to use to buy other coins. So somehow Bitcoin drops in value. The spending power for other coins from already owned um, money invested diminishes a lot. And people will just stop investing in other coins because they've already lost so much they're going to wait for it to go back. I mean, that's the same thing with any investment. You just have to be careful. So I'd recommend that just be careful. Do your homework. I'm not saying not to invest in coins. Just go ahead. Be smart. Don't just take someone else's word for it because they made money because it really doesn't mean anything. So good luck and have a. hopefully we have a great 2018 in the cryptocurrency world.